So you might be in this really weird situation where for some reason your power button on your particular MacBook is just not working. Now, this can happen for a lot of different reasons. As most of you know though, the power button on your particular MacBook is right here. So if I go and swing my MacBook over, the power button can be in a different, couple of different spots depending on what type of MacBook you have. But the very, very first thing I'd recommend doing is making sure that you're actually clicking on the right button. So this is the power button right here. It's usually at the end of the touch bar if you have a different type of MacBook, it's all the way at the end. Hold down on this particular power button right here and see if it you know, kind of powers on your MacBook. What you want to do if it's not doing, you know, if it's not working out well, is to press it down a little bit harder. Sometimes you may just have to go through and just press on your MacBook, you know, keyboard a little bit harder in order to actually go and you know, signify that there's been some change or whatever. So depending on what type of MacBook, you know, model you have, hold it down, press it down a little bit harder, and that's the first thing I'd recommend doing. Now, the number one reason why something like this ends up happening is usually because your MacBook that you have just isn't really charged up. So you want to grab that USB Type-C cable or, you know, MagSafe cable, whatever you have to charge up your MacBook, and you want to go ahead and plug it in. A lot of the times, a lot of the times, the reason why your MacBook is not charging up or is not powering is because it's not charged up at all. So go through, plug in your particular MacBook, and then at the same time, you want to go do the exact same thing we just did. So plug it in, and then you want to hold down on the power button, and before you even have to do it, you can see that your MacBook may start powering on. So if that ends up happening, if it's stuck on that display, then that's a different issue. But if it's now starting to power up, that may mean that your particular MacBook, the power button and everything is working fine. It's just that your MacBook hasn't been updated in a long time or that it hasn't been charged in a long time. So try going through, try charging up your MacBook from that particular perspective. And that might be a way to go and fix the problem too. If you do that and that's still not working, you can also try going through and updating your MacBook. So if you're able to power it on, try updating it. If it's still not working, the power button may be faulty. You may have to actually do a hardware you know, restore. You, know, you may have to actually take it into the Apple Store and have them fix it for you. But those are the first things that I recommend doing to fix this particular problem on your particular MacBook. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video.